Siamo qui con William De Wilder, um, Global Chief Investment Officer, Strategy and Partners di BMP Paribas IP, che ci racconterà il suo outlook per il secondo semestre del 2013. Good morning, Mr. De Wilder. Uh, Hello. Could you tell us your outlook for the second half? The outlook for the second half depends on two factors. One is uh, when will the US bond market stabilize? Uh, this is an important question because the stabilization of the bond market should then make it possible for investors to come back into equity markets and into corporate bond markets. Point number two is what is going to happen to the business cycle in China. At the moment there is a lot of worry about uh, Chinese growth slowing, about the hard landing risk. If that would be the case it would of course be bad news for developed markets as well and that is why over the coming three months, we will have to follow with great attention what is happening in that country. Okay, and so what is your advice in the short term and in the medium term? In the short term, we uh, continue to be rather cautious in the current market environment. It is related to a very nervous environment, uh, simply because investors still need to get used to the fact that the monetary policy in the United States is normalizing. Uh, we've seen that recently when we had the jobs numbers being released in the United States, they were good and US bond yields moved up 20 basis points. That's a lot. So in the short run, uh, we're still pretty cautious. However, in the medium term, the advice clearly is that you have to move into what I would call risky assets, that is uh, equities, that is uh, corporate bonds and even emerging market bonds. The reason why is that some interest rates set by central banks will stay very low. In Europe, actually, they could even go lower. And in the US, the first interest rate hikes will only occur early 2015. So interest rates will stay very low for several years to come. And that means that uh, investors, when they are looking for uh, more attractive investment opportunities, they have to take risk. What's important as well is that the cyclical environment uh, which we're experiencing in the world economy is improving um, a little bit uh, in the Western world. Uh, US is doing a bit better. Europe actually from a very low level is picking up some speed and Japan does the same thing. So this is also something which is rather favorable for, for equity markets. Thank you. You're welcome.